Chapter 2. Planning and Coordination Good planning before and during a disaster is a critical part of any effective response. Planning should be initiated in advance by senior emergency management and developed jointly with groups like the police, government, the voluntary sector, faith representatives, and all other relevant authorities and organizations. Prior coordination can help you assess the roles, scale, and scope of the response needed, as well as identify required resources, including protective gear, transport, and storage. Draw up a plan of action for managing the dead or missing, communicate with families and communities, and ensure that culturally appropriate practices are followed. Effective coordination is vital across all levels of response. At the local level, coordination must happen as soon as possible in accordance with disaster management plans. A local coordinator who has the right expertise and doesn't have critical medical responsibilities must be appointed to take responsibility for the dead and establish a team. Someone should also be put in charge of one or more of each of the activities covered in the Management of Dead Bodies After Disasters Field Manual. At the regional or national level, an appropriate authority should establish a coordination group with specific advisors for logistical support, technical support, legal issues, communications, and a liaison for diplomatic missions and international organizations. With a clear understanding of the do's and don'ts of planning and coordination, you can make respectful recoveries, ensure dignified management of the dead, and facilitate reunification.